of course. Um, yeah, I have uh, a little pepper spray on the keychain, and uh, I have like a little tiny uh, pocket knife thing in my, well, not my pocket. <laughs> Maybe you can figure that out, you know, when do girls have pockets in their jeans anymore? Um, and let's see, anything else? Oh yeah, um, my friend is going to teach me some kickboxing moves. He's gotten pretty good at it and he kind of knows. Um, I've done it before in the past, um, so I kind of know some kickboxing moves, but I'm probably a skill learner. I need to <laughs> brush up on those. And I actually just finished a firearms training um, for beginners. So I actually do know how to use um, a little like handheld gun. Uh, one of those, what are they called, Glocks or something? <laughs> it's normally, it's not me, but you know, gotta be safe. <laughs> Better safe than sorry, right? Um, but it's not always uh, physical. I, I do have some like other things that, um, that I think of, like uh, like if I'm traveling on foot somewhere or something, um, I'll look around uh, like at the ground for shadows. You know, when it's like really sunny outside and then you can see your shadow, it can be on the right or the left or like directly in front of you. That way I can see if uh, anyone's approaching me from behind or anything like that, I'll see their shadow first um, so if you see their shadow first, it'll take you, you know, or it'll give you an extra two or three seconds to uh, run away <laughs> if you need to. Um, and I don't, I don't know. I mean, this has worked for me. It's kind of odd, but um, like, like when you get catcalled, well, I don't know if you've ever been catcalled before, you're a guy. Um, but uh, like if, if you get catcalled or like some random person on the street is like coming and trying to talk to you or whatever like that. Um, the first thing that I do is I like start to talk like in a really low voice and I try to like talk like a guy because then they get like really turned off most of the time. And so, you know, <laughs> if they, if they feel the need, like, like they're going to like attack like a female, if you confuse them a little bit, then they kind of freak out and then, you know, they just kind of go away on their own. Um, and for that reason too, I'll try to like, I'll try to walk like a guy, you know, like I'll like keep like this like angry smolder face on, you know, like just kind of looking around, you know, or like I'll have my hands in my pockets and like um, if you if you like hold a fist a little bit in your pocket, it looks like you're holding something like you're ready to just pull something out, you know, if somebody like comes up and attacks you and it's, um, you know, it's it's pretty it's pretty effective, I would say. <laughs> I've done it enough and haven't been attacked yet, so I'm assuming those techniques work. And I probably, to be honest with you, I probably have about 30 or so license plate numbers memorized in my head because um, that's important. <laughs> you know, I mean, before you get into somebody else's car, like on a date or even a family member or a friend, you know, you just never know. You just never know. <laughs>